Hello guys and welcome back to another Haller for an Hour. This time we're checking out a game called Rift Adventure, which is kind of inexplicable. I'm going to read the description. Rift Adventure is a 2D platformer of action and adventure and RPG elements with retro pixel art style that seeks to educate and raise awareness of young people, teenagers, and also homesick players about tax, tax education, citizenship, and cause and consequence of your actions. It is a furry action adventure game. It has furry characters. But it's also supposed to teach you about taxes. I... I honestly don't understand this, and I wanted to see it for myself. <laughs> no Yoshi commits tax fraud here, my friends. This is anti-tax fraud. Uh, <laughs> but in any case, yeah, let's check it out. I'm really not sure what to expect out of this one. I was just like, what is this? Excuse me? No, they made a big deal out of it. I don't think it's a joke. Um, it was actually on several different like pages about the game, so... I don't know, let's, let's find out. Of course, first, if you like the video, do you think about giving a like? And if you haven't subscribed yet, think about doing that as well. If you really want to help out, come over to Twitch. I'm trying to reach partner, but I need more viewers to do it, so if you want to come by to lurk or talk, think about doing that, because it raises the view count and helps me out immensely. Also, we have a pretty cool Discord community, if you want to check that out. And I have a coffee link now, if you want to help directly monetize my content. So, links are in the description. Check them out, if you care. And let's go ahead and start playing. Tax evasion. We're not doing that here. This is about. This is about. This is the. T this game is to teach you about responsible taxation practices. I. I don't know. <laughs> Let me know if the volume is too quiet. By the way. Also, we're. I guess we're gonna play as a lomb. What. What is. What is ratchet species? Lombax. Can't remember. It, it looks like our lombax. Let's be honest. <laughs> Axius. <laughs> Axius? Okay. No need to be afraid, buddy. Based on what I have seen in there, this is going to be our last ride, I swear. Partners? I'll move the character. Uh, sure. I guess I'm going to play as the swole buddy guy. Oh, okay. Well, I got some moves. Bye. Oh. This game, this does seem very quiet. Is this too quiet? I can turn it up more if you want. Elder climb change rougher put yep. Wow. <laughs> I'm annoyed that he shot one pot but not the other one. How how unthorough. <laughs> I don't recall that being blocked. I'll take care of this. You go get that chest. Okay. Oh, I see. Uh. Okay. Ow. Ow. Okay, it's a charge bar, I see. <laughs> okay, that... That's weird. Well, punching this dummy is a great opportunity for you to show me your skills. Also, I'm... Wow. Tough get our training. Attacks from behind do more damage. Simple as that. Showtime. Okay. I think he's out of money. I think the cat has a sheet. I can't tell, maybe. I can already smell the gold. I can talk. She has a badly voice, it's fine. You're so quiet today. How about a race to cheer you up? If you win, I'll let you choose where we are going on our next trip. I'm feeling kind today, so I'll give you a head start. But we're rocked to those pillars. Okay. I win. Wow, congratulations! You really are taking it seriously. I missed the coin, though. I'll make sure not to cut you some slack next time. Oh no! Oh no, it's that lich guy. What's what's this? Here, Krenus, I think he's froze to the tomb. Krenus? Krenus, these names. Axius, get ready to run! I think I know who he is! At last, freedom! A yellow cat and a blue rabbit? Where's my army? That's not how I envisioned my return. How long has it been? Only one way to find out. 
It can't be, no! Silence! Though the fear, the horror, is so clear now. The anguish that once destroyed me is the only way to find real answers. Something's never changed, not even the face of eternity. Yeah? You are coming with me! I, You have the answers I need. What? Prittis! I guess I'll just kind of hang out. Stop it. Bad. Okay, well, bye. Um. Hmm. I missed a coin, but that's fine. How am I going to do my taxes if I don't properly document all the money I find? Two things are certain. Death and taxes. We got the lich part, so we got the death part. Fanny district? Ah, oh, yes, I love the fanny district. Mir Demakos, Kratos was kid kidnapped. I don't like these names. They're kind of weird and hard to say. <laughs> it was just a matter of time till both of you get in some real trouble. What happened, young Axius? X X it was a strange monster in the cave. After that, portals started appearing everywhere. Portals? That's strange. Yes, but it doesn't matter who or what we're facing here. I'm gonna go save my partner. He said something about- See, he said- Wait, no, that's the lich said it. Well, how are you- why, Well, we were- Well, why you know what gender the lich is? It was just a bunch of bones. Don't miss gender. You don't know what gender he is. She is. It is. Axius, one of these portals. Show up in the central square. I might have to check the ancient manuscripts. Be careful, young man. Vathos. That definitely helps. I'll go check these portals for clues. Don't stab me, ow. Come back to Fanny whenever possible. It's the only place in Miles where you'll find help. Make sure you negotiate your goods so our village can grow. See, Fanny is the only place in Miles where you can get help. It's unfortunate that, with that name. I like our crocodile guards, though. Hello, traveler. Found anything good in the dungeons? Take your treasure to the street market. May catch the attention of a few merchants. I say he's at level 3 out of 5. Wow, already? Earnings are still modest. Gotta keep those bargains coming. I, I see. Mm -hmm. Hello? Hello, Captain? Attention! Are you here to give me a hand with the defense plans? Uh. Night evasion is all the way. Every turn HP is according to the city level. Successful defense principle level increase in evasion in two turns. What's a turn? Okay. At ease, soldier. I. Alright. Mechanics. I don't quite understand them, but mechanics. 120? Oh, yeah, it says at the top. Alright, uh, how's that advance exactly? Oh. Hello. Hey, healer, how's it going? Oh, I guess work never stops in this village. Tell me, how can I help you? You can receive free treatment once every turn here. Healing capacity varies according to this level. Okay. Oh, I actually am injured, I think about it. Let me, uh, actually ask for help. Wait, how do I actually select that I... Game's a little weird with its controls. Why is... Okay. Ah, there we go. Okay. Figured it out. Oh, Crimson, thank you! Oh, those announcement messages... The announcement sounds are still off. Let me fix that. They were off for Halloween, but I meant to turn them back on. Just a moment on that. There we go. <laughs> Scams? What? How so? Oh, hello? Well, this is my favorite place in the village. How's it going? Fresh and tasty! Buy a meal! Have a sit! In that order? Okay. Wait, wait, wait. I have an emerald. Except, I can buy a sour clover. It's... okay. Rich and Sigma 12. Come back often! Should you need it, we also have takeout! 
Now I'm even hungrier. Oh. Oh, hello. <laughs> Hi there. <laughs> Giraffe. Hello, Mrs. Blacksmith. Miss Jack Blacksmith, I need to upgrade my equipment. Okay, let's see. What do we have here? Um. That. I cannot upgrade it. I'll, you know, I'll sell that. Still can't buy it, though. Mm -hmm. Good doing business with you. It's okay, if I break enough people's possessions of crates, I eventually will have enough money. Who's playing the guitar? What's up, Glenn? Hey there, do you like my music? Wait till you see my goods. You also have a dagger. Hmm. Four damage, huh? Wait, what's the difference between... Need it already? Stay a little longer. Let me tell you something. Uh, no. I need to, I need to see what my inventory is. Do I... Do I apparently do not have a weapon. Wait, how can I upgrade nothing? Let me figure this out. Oh, I see. You sell me... Oh, wait, you're selling me a dagger for 300. That does four damage. Wait a minute. So they're selling me a dagger that does three does does four damage for three hundred. You're selling me a dagger which does four damage for two hundred twenty-five. So in other words, the blacksmith is ripping me off. Got it. Uh, I guess I'll buy this. There we go. Achievement unlocked. Welcome to the machine. Okay. So Glenn is the specials. The specials? I don't understand. Well, that is more damage, so. Turn by turn, day by day. Oh, so, in other words, I got a bit of a lucky draw there, effectively. His inventory changes, and he offers some good deals, basically. This game has presented itself kind of oddly here. Like, at first, at least. I guess we'll see where it goes with this. I like how the music is basically a MIDI file. Actually, it's not just basically. Oh, I can hop up here. So, what purpose do I can I do this? Secret. Secret. Can I can I cook myself? I don't know. <laughs> I guess let's go in here. Entrance gardens one ten. So this is. I'm not actually sure. Any. I'm really confused by this game right now. Let's let's see how it goes. I guess. I'm guessing the turn thing is basically every time I go back to town, it, it's an advancement of a turn. Is this a roguelike then? Or... Because that seems like a roguelike structure. I guess we'll find out. I mean, I took a lot of damage from that trap earlier, so I know already that I can get hurt very easily. The Caves of Athos! I know this place. It suits that monster well, but I have no time for this. I must find Critis! Oh god, I thought it was acid, it's just water. Not the most observant snake, but all right. Why is there a timer at the top of the screen? Oh well. Where are we gonna play our? T I'm kind of curious where the the t learning about taxes thing comes in. Oh my god, did you see it? I feel like the controls are slightly jank. Oh my goodness, hello. Well, apparently upgrade to the dagger was a good decision on my part. Okay, there we go. That's, uh... Oh, okay. Now they mentioned that my dodge thing can air dash, but I guess it makes sense. Oh, okay. Oh, I can I can just see when it's attacking because of the bar at the top of the screen, or uh, it has a little recharge bar thing and tells me when it's gonna do its attack. This will be harder than I thought. 
I should go back to the city of Fatty and restock my supplies for the time being. I think you're fine. We haven't even gotten injured, you know, but... Tomb Rabbit, what's up here? I found a secret. That wall was obviously going on. Something was a... Like, oh my goodness, I, I went through a small portion of this dungeon. I'm exhausted. Holy shit. I've taken zero damage. I must I must recover. Oh, well, that is... While I'm annoyed I fell down, I am glad to learn that there's no fall damage. Actually, I wonder if the timer has something to do with turns. If it does, it's not very clear what it means. The, sh the shredding noise is off-putting. When I never have dash sound... Oh, it's because every single time I'm dashing so hard I'm pulling a tendon. I'm, I'm tearing a tendon, that's why. Don't worry about it. it ha it's just a consequence of, you know, going that fast. <laughs> that's what it makes me think of, anyways. You're shredding space. Speaking of shredding, I should play Guild Wars 2 again for a stream. I'm in an area that has one of the best meta events I've ever seen. Let me guess, not good enough time to get three stars. Oh, I don't give a shit. I hate three star systems in video games. I've mentioned this before. It's also, it's way too mobile-esque also. <laughs> At least I hate them when they're dependent on multiple factors that don't jive well with each other. I'm talking about the bad one. Yeah, so there's, an, there's a meta event, which, if you don't know what a meta event uh, in an MO, that's basically like an event that happens. It's kind of a area-based event that's kind of like the big the big event of the area. And there is an event in, in this area, I'm in Guild Wars 2, which is literally a metal concert. It's literally a metal concert three with three actual legitimately good metal songs. Um, it's pretty good. <laughs> Young Axius, did you find anything about Critus' whereabouts? It's not a proper sentence, Mayor. Not yet, Mayor, but I, f I feel she's in Mathos. I see. Please restock your supplies before heading to your next adventure. Not long ago, you were nothing but kids played around. Seems to have, I have, seems to have to take care of each other, force you both to grow up. I'm sure she's waiting for you. Feel free to make use of all our services. Remember, being reasonable doesn't always mean being right. What? <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Hey, having fun? Thought you were going to help. How much to collect these days? So he's level 2 out of 5. Wait, did it go down? Spent somebody in the local shops that may improve. Okay, Mayor, I see. You want to steal my money. I get it. Hi, what's up with the evasion? Uh, evasion next turn. Okay, got it. I returned to Mouth Loop. Was this not on the list? Yeah, it's Rift Adventure. It's what we have currently marked, if you're talking about this game. But yeah, a legitimate metal cause. It's quite interesting. Oh, well, we skipped a few games, Creature, because they are Switch games, and I have enough Switch games to make an episode. So I'm not doing that right now. A whole, a whole howler can be Switch games. I'll just save them for then. So, if I don't want the town's level to go down, I have to buy items. Pulsating as blood, powerful as dragons. Cool, I'll sell it. I wonder if I need that money for something. I wonder if I need those items for something else. Oh well. <laughs> Ever go to a restaurant and just sell them gems? <laughs> Works out. <laughs> what do you mean the healer as a bow doesn't look so good? Oh yeah, there's a lot more stuff here. Curse, I, I thought it was a cursed dagger. I was like, I don't want to buy a cursed dagger. Mm -hmm. I dare you sell your dragon power. What kind of Shadoxine are you? One that helps for a greater return later. Oh, you're right. It looks really messed up now. Did it always look that bad? Or does it just look that bad because the thing's leveled down? Hi, Clay. What are you selling? Oh, a lot, actually. Wait, are you just always going to sell the same things as the blacksmith, but cheaper? Interesting. So that dagger does less damage, but has a 4% chance to crit. I don't think that sounds worthwhile. Uh, I'll take the armor, though. Wait, two, two, 240. Okay, what was the price of the other one? <laughs> 
Off to the world for a dragon to join. Hey there, Mal. How you doing? Huh. First time chat for viewer. Interesting. Did you switch accounts or something? Because I know you definitely spoke on a different account before. Oops, I went too far. <laughs> So let's see. Yeah, 320. What is the point of this? Why does the Glen always sell things for cheaper? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, so Glen doesn't help the town. Okay, I think I get it now because he's just a traveler. It says right there, black market. Oh, it does? Oh, so it does. <laughs> I didn't really notice that. Ever just go to a black market, you're not aware you're at the black market. <laughs> so, in other words, if I don't... Okay, so I need to buy local... Support local businesses. Alright, cool. <laughs> Bat Slayer. So I guess this is the tax lesson, don't buy for the black market, buy, buy, buy for legitimate businesses. Is that the tax lesson? <laughs> sure, why not? <laughs> Also, uh, hey, Malfred, are you actually the real Malfred or just a fad account? Ooh. Ooh. I wasn't expecting such a fast attack. Did I just stand at him? Sure, why not? Smiley face. An interesting reply. <laughs> I think I, I think I dealt that one. Oh. I had a feeling. Because, like, I didn't hear anything about Mal's ult. I know Mal has been on the stream before. He has, it's a different account than this one, so I was like, hmm. This game seems alright. Controls are a bit stiff, though, actually. It's not the worst game, but just to mention that. Ow, goddammit. My worst enemy, bats. This does raise a point, though. I really should talk to Mal again. It's been a little while. I meant to hit him up again and see how he's doing at some point. I've just been so busy. So you have popsicle. Oh, okay. Well, I guess in retrospect that was marked, but I don't know how one would have figured that out. Also, I just restarted? What? I thought there would be a bigger penalty than that. All right. Yeah, I would say, please don't impersonate the other people. A little weird. Also, that trap sucked. 
Yeah, I don't think Mal would appreciate a, a person near myself. Um, knowing that he's been through some tough times as well, and part of that is... Well, I, just to put it simply, an impersonator would not make th life any easier for him. I'll put it that way. Sorry to know that. It's okay. It's okay. I understand being a fan. But, uh, yeah. The problem is when... The problem is, uh, if you're- if you're fat if you're a fan of somebody and you're like, I'm a fan of them, I want to basically have their name and have their picture. That's not being a fan, that's- that's impersonation. It's different. I know you probably didn't mean any harm. But I'd have- I'd recommend a unique name account. Or, you know what, if you really want to express you're a fan, uh, make your own unique dragon inspired off of Malfurin's, uh, dragon. That's, that's, that's always a way to be a fan. Like, I like that he always designed this way, so I'm gonna design my own dragon this way. That sort of thing. At least I've, I've seen a few people do that. Oh, this was a dead end the whole time. Tell Mal be a bad idea. I don't think that's necessary. The guy seems to understand that, you know, impersonation ain't the best thing. I don't think there's any malicious intent here. So I died to a trap, but the game didn't really penalize me that much. Ah. I, I could I guess I guess I see how you could tell there's a trap there, yeah. One star, because I'm not fast enough. I hate time I hate time trials. You designed your Shadoxian partly after Mal. Yeah. My my redesign specifically. Not the original Shadoxian. The original Shadoxian was just my own design. Oh no, the fatty is under attack. <laughs> Okay. Hi, um... Okay. I was wondering how this mechanic would exactly work. I guess I put it this way, I don't think Mal needs to be told about this unless the guy keeps using that account. At least, unless unless the guy keeps impersonating it, basically. But if he decides to switch to a more unique account, then I, I don't see any reason that it needs to continue as an issue. That's my thoughts, anyways. <laughs> What's this game about? Uh, it's an action adventure, and it's about proper tax procedures. That may sound like a joke, but that's kind of what the description demonstrated. It seems to be demonstrating that by buying local. Seems like you, if you don't buy a local, you, your town level decreases, so... Hooray, we're successfully defended, even though there's still enemies on the wall. So since I bought a sword, does that mean the town's level went back up, or I'm not really sure. Three out of three twenty. I assume three out of twenty, right? Very good. We have resisted evasion of the diaphores. The diaphores. Thanks for telling me. You no problem, dude. Hope to see you on. A, I hope to see you back on a unique account later. I say remain strong. Say a little. Same, still the same. You can keep the loot. <laughs> Thanks. What city level do we have? Mm -hmm. Three. Yeah. So it went back up because I bought a sword. Mm -hmm. Instead of buying from the black market, I bought it from local, so. I, 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 I understand now. The black market can be a local business. I'll just pressure Glenn to put towards the city's taxes or something. Hi, can you Ooh. heal me? Yeah, I'll do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, his, his hut looks a little bit better when it's not level two. Mm 
Oh my, why do you always have shitty equipment? Alright, wait, hold on. Um, it's dumb that selling items doesn't, uh... I mean, I guess I'll buy, uh, another... Dagger. Sure. Or... Yay, thank you. If I buy the dagger and immediately sell it back... Actually, I'm not gonna sell it back to you, I'm just gonna buy it. Mm -hmm. There, thanks for the dagger, I'm not gonna use it. But... I need to support my local businesses, so there. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Food? I guess I could do that too. Hmm. I'm kinda curious though. Yeah, it says nothing different here. It always says stay a little longer, let me tell you something. Tell me... So there's a... So there's a total of 20 levels in this then? Hmm. Remember to equip the Curved Dagger. I mean, it does less damage, but... I guess I could. It does less damage, though. It's actually kind of shitty. I know what it's trying to do. Like, look. It's like, oh, it does one less damage, but it has a chance to crit. But that chance is 4%. percent i am not... No. <laughs> A 4% chance is not good for one less- 25% less damage. <laughs> what if you're really lucky? Doesn't sound like me, man. <laughs> Damn it, I want a burger. I don't know, there's talk about food earlier, now I'm just like, burger. But see, there's really no reason I should get a burger. I got a calzone yesterday, so I have really no reason to get a burger today. At least on the subject of... On the subject of not eating too much fast food or something. Looks like all these uses of pyro will be useful now. At least I'm not afraid of water. Hey, <laughs> I will find you. What? Hee <laughs> hee, I will find you. What? Who, who are you trying to find? Nah, fuck it. I'm just a little bit This is a, like, hee hee, who, I'll find you. Who are you trying to find? Are you trying to find your kidnapped friend or are you trying to find the lich? Regardless, I don't think hee hee really works in that situation. <laughs> There was no burger in my calzone. No, it was not a burger calzone, but it does sound kind of interesting, though. Like, why not have a calzone and you put a burger inside of it? Yeah, I'm down for that. It sounds good. Do I drown eventually? Oh. Okay, I can't swim. I can only- I'm- apparently I'm very, very dense. <laughs> so, <laughs> I cannot swim upwards. You have a ton of money, what are you gonna use it on? Burgers. That's that decision's kind of obvious. Ah, oh, the bat got me. Rats. Or rather bats. Um Alright, what's what's that there's another path over here, hold on. Where's this go? Wait. Yeah, this way. Is this thing gonna really shoot a fireball underwater? Okay, sure. What are you, Super Mario Brothers? <laughs> All right, let's see. Hmm. I am dense, yes. I guess in multiple ways thinking about it. So this game is a game. 
Oh shit. Thankfully that trap triggered before I dropped out onto it. I do wonder why they made such a big deal of the whole tax thing. Uh, Ha. I'm not so sure about multiple ways. Fat is less dense than water. Not if you have a ton of it. Now, now if you're a fat dragon. I think a fat dragon could just st step to the bottom of the lake if they want to do. <laughs> You have to keep in mind, I don't have just fat as a Shadoxian. I have a lot of muscle, too. Hello. Is it just me, or is the town music happier now? People of Forever City, wherever you've been doing it, it's working. Things are looking up. I bought a dagger I didn't want, and now I'm going to go sell it. That's what I did, Mayor. I'm fucking amazing. <laughs> Oh, four out of five. A little more of my pockets will be full. I'm in the city. See you with full joy. <laughs> yeah, the music changed. All right, if you're a black hole of fat, then sure, you're more dense. Yep. <laughs> Next evasion, two turns. Okay. What I'm confused about is if I sell the item, does that also affect the town level, like, in, like negatively? Because I sold it again? I'm not sure. Well, the healer's place looks a little bit better. Mm -hmm. Just be the lake. Yeah, I could do that. Just drink on the whole lake, have a sloshy belly. Sloshy dragon belly full of lake. <laughs> All right, I'll buy some food this time. Assuming the blacksmith has something useful. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. It feels like it felt like appropriate for the conversation. I need to. Burp. Oh, hey, there's all sorts of stuff. I guess if the town level goes up, I get more options for. Yeah, that's cool, actually. So is there actually a good weapon now? Let's see. Five five damage and six percent chance of crit, or seven damage. What I love is that the prices seem to think that the chance to crit is really amazing, because look, this seven damage sword is 680. This five damage sword is 660, only 20 gold less, because... Oh, because that six percent chance of crit really makes it amazing, I guess. I don't know. I'll go with the long sword, sure. an upgrade, as far as I'm concerned. Mm -hmm. It's probably good to raise the town level also just to, you know, increase the items I can get. I bought a hospital and now the dagger is three, th now the hospital, I made a dagger and now the hospital is three, three percent more effective and I was able to buy all the second floor. I'm very impressed with my taxes, I guess, now. Actually, Glenn's really bored, though, if he just sells the same things as everybody else. What? Underground Fortress, sure. Oh, so how you doing, Dante? N nice Fultzel there, I like that. You reminded me that Fultzels are good. They have good hips. I rate Pokemon based on hips. <laughs> oh, no. Would it, be, would it be amusing if I made a semi-shit post video? Where I just ranked Pokemon based on hips or something. Like this Pokemon is thick, ergo it's it it's it is ranked number five. <laughs> but it's not as thick as this Pokemon, so it's only ranked number five. Like <laughs> Maybe I should just rank Pokemon based on sexiness or something, effectively. But like make it more funny than just oh I think this is sexy. More just this has good thighs, that has good thighs. Gudra, very good thighs. Only if it's literally every single Pokemon. No, I'd actually, like, choose. Half joke video, half- Yes, I actually like these Pokemon. For this reason. Use one of those tierless creators. Absolutely. I've been thinking about- I don't really care for tierless videos, except for Tierzu, because Tierzu was doing it before it was cool. Also, his videos are amazing. If you don't know what Tier Zoo is, it's basically it's a channel that basically treats treats the real world as if it's a video game and talks about um, animals and stuff as if they are classes in a video game. 
like, you know, like the... <laughs> He, he refers to things in video game terms, like there was the Cretaceous meta, for instance. <laughs> like that. <laughs> or the big balance patch where dinosaurs were removed. I love Tier Zoo, it's great. If you if you don't watch Tier Zoo, check them out. They're also scientifically, they're just interesting too, because it's, it's actually, it's learning as well. Like, they, he teaches you stuff about edibles, it's neat. Make the same styles as Dark Souls Vor tier list. Yeah, actually, it's exactly sort of what I mean. Like, kind of a, a video that's clearly not too serious, but also technically accurate. <laughs> Ow, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, of course, they're not affected by traps. I hate those traps. They're a little hard to see. Why do I hear Glenn's guitar? I hear Glenn's guitar. Is he is he uh, in the in here somewhere? If so, why? Oh, fuck! Alright. Oh, no, poison! I'm fine. It's fine. That's weird, all these monsters! All those monsters, they look nothing like the animals around here! They are. They are dead! I'm taking first stage just to figure that out, huh? C congratulations. I'm gonna guess since this was a cutscene area, this is forward progress. I'm gonna go back down. I should have bought some food. I'm gonna take cars of ice if I make it through this. Oh shit, it dropped. Alright, I guess let's all keep the economy stimulated. I'll buy teriyaki sushi, whatever. Whatever the, whatever the octopus is selling, I don't know. Hi, what's up? What's up, Glenn? Why are you just here? Guess there's no harm selling my gemstone. There we go. I wasn't buying from him enough, so he's trying to branch out and get my attention. Will the hips be rated by proportion or diameter? Well, I, I could technically go into detail about why I think each Pokemon with hips, good hips, are good. Admittedly, though, maybe that's too specialized. I should make it more of a fat Pokemon tier list rather than just hips. I like the idea of hips, though, because I got I got a. And I don't mean this sexually, but I have a. I do legitimately have a thigh fetish, effectively, where I'm like I like thick thighs. I cannot lie, kind of thing. It's 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 tied into my fat for interest, obviously, but it's a, it's like a specific. Uh, part of that fat for interest. Just don't lie. Exactly. Pokemon Paw tier list? I could. I could have multiple tier lists if I wanted to. Do the hips. Hips. See, doing based on hips, though, rather than pure fat fur, is also, like, considering curvaceousness. So you could have thin characters with good hips, too. For instance, Lipart's got good hips. Lipart's a pretty lithe Pokemon, but that, that, that Pokemon has good hips potential. The music got even happier. Honestly, it's it, you know I like I, the city. The city battle aspect is interesting, but also way too easy. Like, oh, what did you do? I bought a couple weapons, and thus our city is maximum prosperity. Like, yay! <laughs> that was easy. <laughs> Dracozol. Oh god, Dracozol's got crazy hips proportions because he's technically a mix of two two creatures. Incorrectly put together. Hmm. Alright, heal me up. Mm -hmm. Buy food this time, baby? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Did I pass the food place? No, I didn't pass the food place yet. It seems people are down for a hips video. Cool. <laughs> Uh, if, it, if it does well, I'll, I'll use one of those tier list creators and I'll I'll do that, actually. It sounds like fun. I think I'll just do it on a stream at some point because I don't want to make a video. That takes a lot of work. But I can do tier list on stream. Why not? Alright, I'm going to buy a mushroom. 
Yeah. I'll buy, I'll buy, buy more than one. Oh, I can only buy one item at, one item, one unique item at once. You can't get duplicates. Okay, I'll just buy one of each. There we go. Alright, what we got? What do we got here? 8% chance to block for it, 4% chance to crit. Well, I'll take the 15 HP, thanks. I'm fucking rich, yo. I can buy anything. <laughs> as long as I keep finding the secret paths, I'll have tons of money. Alright, have this other thing. Please. You have to walk away from them to talk to them again. You gotta walk away to reset the prompt. So wait, do I have to make sure I buy something every single time? That might be tricky, actually. Yeah, he just... He literally just sells everything everybody else sells. Oh, a boss fight. In the Pain Dungeon. <laughs> or maybe it's just a really hard level, I don't know. Let's go to the Pain Dungeon. I'm not sure if Dracozult would end up on my hip tier list, though, because he's technically two Pokemon put together incorrectly, so he, the five potential is kind of marred by um, the fact he's technically mutated. <laughs> Hello. You must be one of his henchmen. You're bigger and red, so you must be a boss. If you dare to fight the Aphorus, <laughs> my name is Agony the Executioner. It's time to die. Kneel before me. Okay. I bet you listen to Lincoln Park with a name like that. Okay. Let me just see your pattern before I fight you proper. Okay. Is that all you do? Alright then. Oh, you do a little mix of things. Okay. Seems like three hits is safe. Oops. Maybe two. You should be- oh, fuck's sake, die. Dude, what the fuck's wrong with you? Wait, I heard that double growl. What's, what are you doing? Please die, thank you. Fuck's sake, man, you ran out of health bar. Stop it. <laughs> Capra Demon, that you? Except for he, he didn't sick two dogs on me, though. Darn it. Where's Critus? <laughs> Very well, then. But be warned, you may not like what you find. Proceed further ahead. She's at the Shrine of Destiny. What do you mean by not liking what I find? <laughs> <They died. laughs> what? I'm gonna go deeper into an undead crypt? What do you mean I won't like what I find? Am I gonna find sunshine and rainbows and love hops? God, how do you get more than one star? Holy shit. Use item? Oh uh, yeah, sure, I guess I'll do that. Mewtwo? Is he also banned because of genetic No, he's in a properly balanced genetic combination. It's fine. I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat a... That. And, uh... That. Okay. Oh, wait, shit. Hello. Oh, I blocked. How did I do that? Ah, oh, you know, I just realized that boss would have taken forever if I had it. Hello. If I had to upgrade my equipment, I probably would have been trouble there. Hmm. This is an annoying enemy to get behind. Look at look at this.
That, that's actually a really... Oh, dash. Yeah, I guess that, that's... Like, that, like, oh, can I dash through enemies? Yeah, I guess that would make sense. That that makes a lot more sense. Thank you. <laughs> don't know why I don't think I've used my dash more offensively. All right, your leisure. Hello. All right. Well, that's that. I like how the big buff guy. It's like, yes, my soldiers, fight! Fight the invaders! I shall stand here, buffly! <laughs> like, I just realized he's not helping. <laughs> you need my overseeing. That is my role. <laughs> that feels like there should be more city levels. His muscles boost morale, exactly. I kind of feel like I've already kind of won. I mean, yeah, I haven't been in the game, but like... I guess a bit healing. So I just have to make sure I buy at least one item from the... not the black market. Every time I go to town, and I, I guess the town will be fine, and then everything's fine forever. <laughs> I guess? Yeah. Economies are easy! <laughs> this taught me a lot about taxes, like the fact that as long as I occasionally buy goods, I, no, then I'm, everything will be fine. <laughs> as long as I do it on the up and up. <laughs> do more items unlocked as we go, or. Oh, yeah, I guess so. What we got? King Sword, that's expensive. Blonde Emperors from far distant ages. Yeah, I'll buy it. Mm -hmm. Now I'm actually kind of out of money. <laughs> mm -hmm. Alright, off I go. <laughs> These weapons are getting prohibitively expensive. <laughs> Alright. I could probably... Further levels require town improvements. Oh. I mean... If those exist. I'm not really sure. Does, is there more of an upgrade system to this? Enemy strength went up. So the extra damage I'm dealing is not actually as impressive as I was hoping it would be. That's okay. Totems! Trick is ready to jewels of their eyes. Uh, okay. I, uh, yeah. I mean, occasionally they move. I, I guess. It's down here. Oh, it's just a, this lets you. Okay. The trick is related to the jewels of their eyes. I, I mean, I completed the puzzle, but I was also confused with that bet. I mean, they sure have jewels in their eyes. They do. I don't, I don't see the trick, personally. Darn it, they are getting stronger. I need to be more careful moving forward. Yeah, there's a... What's that guy? Like a high-ranking one? Yeah, looks like it. I'm pretty sure I heard a trap. Yep. 
I just, I didn't even <laughs> dodge, I just kind of crawled over him, I was good. Works for me! Oh shit, a dart! How rude. Oh god damn it. I'm fine. Hmm. Damn. I want me to go around, I get it, but uh No? Okay. Whoa! I was gonna see if I could glitch my way on top of it. So that statue moves, but I don't really know how you could tell. Some of them do and some of them don't. They all have the same jewels in their eyes. So I don't really know how you're supposed to figure out which ones move. The tricks to the jewels in their eyes, they said. Uh -huh. this. Oh, God. <laughs> you think you're gonna make a jump, but you don't make it. <laughs> Alright, um... <sighs> Caught me off guards a bit. The dart drives are kind of bullshit in this game, I'm gonna be honest. I am playing as Buddy, yes. This is a kind of a it's a it's a game. <laughs> It plays, it has gameplay, it's a little tricky. You could I don't know, I'm just not really feeling much with this one. It 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 there's nothing really wrong with it. Don't get me wrong. But I'm not I feel nothing. <laughs> I guess I don't it, it it is perfectly competent. And uh, certainly a game that can be played. But this game you said it's based in, the game that you said it's inspired by, what was it, Two Kingdoms? Then I guess that was Two Kings probably has a little more depth to the concept. Yeah, the, the, the tax thing, as far as I can tell, the whole teaching people... The, the game, the description in Steam literally goes off about how it teaches, like, young people about your taxes and proper finances. And I guess they what they mean by that is... Hey, look, if you buy from the black market, the town gets less prosperous. <laughs> like, I... I guess that's the lesson? Kingdom Tooth Crowns, right? Alright, hold on a minute. I need to sell you this clover so I can buy this clover so the town level stays up. <gasps> yeah, that made a lot of sense. Alright, um... Good night, Blake. Also, I think we're done. I don't really, I don't feel like continuing this. And we're about out of time anyways. This was a game, but it didn't really grab me very much. It doesn't help the controls are just a little bit jank. They're not really that bad, but they are just a little bit jank. So it doesn't feel completely smooth for gameplay, uh, as far as gameplay goes. But also the, the game's concepts, while intriguing in on paper, like how are you gonna teach tax taxes? Oh, it's like pretty dang shallow. Shallow concept. As much as the Steam description played it up, I don't see much 
edu education going on here. Um, as for the actual gameplay, it seems ridiculously simple, easy enough to keep the town level maxed, and not very satisfying as such. It's like, oh, they maxed the town level, woo. And, uh, I don't know, it just looks like, uh, otherwise it's just a game where you delve into dungeon levels, beat stuff up. It's a little bit difficult, you take a lot of damage, so you gotta be careful not to take too much damage. Uh, but if you do die, you just restart the level, I guess. So there's not really much of a penalty for that. It's just, it's, this is a game that exists and you can play it. But there's really nothing here that I find noteworthy or really that makes me go, yes, I want to play this over, you know, the 500 other action platformers that exist. Not really, no. It's it's okay. It's an okay game. They didn't mess it up or anything, really. They just, there's just not much, not enough here to make me go, yes, this specific game is worth playing. But that's just my thoughts. That was Rift Adventure.